The greatest gift to humanity is our individuality. And we have that gift for a reason. And while we may have very, very similar experiences, in reality, we are all individual and all connected. So being individual means being able to let go of those old beliefs that belong to somebody else. We take on so much and can experience other people's emotions as if they are our own. When we have learned from what we've been served, we learn from what we've heard, we learn through our senses and a lot of those things aren't really applicable to us. And so while it is a journey to get through heartbreak, to be willing to dig deeper, to dive into your own heart and to really, really work out who you really are and who you want to be, and why you have experienced the disappointments or the heartbreak that you have in your life, it's totally worth it. Because life is meant to be beautiful. It will absolutely repeat itself to you. It will repeat itself again and again and again until you are willing to step up raise your vibration, raise your frequency, and really truly get to a deeper understanding of what love is. Because only then will you be able to truly know, feel safe within all parameters of love. And that includes heartbreak. Heartbreak is our heart's way of telling us we are so deeply, deeply loved. Heartbreak is our way of saying we deserve more. We deserve to experience more, not from the object of our heartbreak, not through circumstances, but through our own understanding of who we are. We don't deserve more because of the person who's not giving to us what we need and therefore broke our hearts. We deserve more because it's our own heart that is actually magnetizing every experience. So each person who comes into our life is actually a mirror for what we believe about ourselves. And if we experience disappointment, that is a vulnerability we need to heal. And when we do that, when we're willing to do the work, then we get into a space in a place where you're then able to experience love in a much deeper way. And that is ultimately the journey of life. It's about evolving. It's about coming back to the truth of what love really is. And love is one of the most beautiful experiences that we can have. Because although everything in and around us is love, when we experience heart pain, we truly understand what it means to feel. We also understand what it means to feel the limitations of love. And so that heartbreak is an opportunity to break free from those limitations, to experience a much deeper sense of love. We can't avoid it. There are those people who will avoid heartbreak at all costs. Once they've experienced it, they will say, never again, never can I open my heart. Never am I going to be vulnerable. Never am I going to trust. And yet life will force you to do exactly that. So you have a choice now to decide that you're going to use your heartbreak to discover who you really are. You have a choice to discover the truth of what is held in your heart the infinite possibilities that are held in your heart, the infinite possibilities to experience love, to experience yourself as love, but also to be the giver of love as well as the receiver of love. That is what comes with flow in our hearts in the moment our hearts break, actually the walls are broken down and it means that there is greater flow in the heart space. And that greater flow allows love to absolutely transcend any and all limitations. You have to be willing to give yourself permission to truly give permission to feel the heartbreak, permission to feel the disappointment, permission to feel the betrayal, permission to feel all the emotions. Because when you give yourself that permission, the answers will come a lot sooner and it will take you to a high previously unknown. It will help you to evolve, it will help you to grow, but most importantly, when you learn to love, you will be adding to the healing that is needed in humanity. Because what we're experiencing with the chaos in the world right now is a crisis of love. So heartbreak is one of the most amazing experiences we can have. And I know that when you're going through it, it doesn't feel like it. 
But in truth, when you expand your consciousness and you allow yourself to see it through the perspective of evolution, you are then able to see it through the eyes of your heart. And your heart will never betray you. Each situation you attract into your life, your heart is doing it because it wants so much more from you, for you. It wants something better for you. It wants you to experience the magnitude, the magnificence of love, of who you are. This is your opportunity. So when you experience heartbreak, whether you have already or are experiencing it right now, as I speak to you, or if it's something that feels like it's very close on the horizon, sometimes we have a sixth sense for these things. When something's falling apart, whatever that may be, when we lose something or someone we dearly love for whatever reason, if that's where you are, then I invite you to see it through this perspective, to give yourself the space to cry, to dig deep, and to ultimately heal the untruth that is held within you so that you can get to a space and place of truth, a space and place of love, a space and place to evolve to a place where love becomes something that you are totally open to and everything love brings with it, including heartbreak. I invite you to heal that heartbreak, to reconnect to your sense of wholeness, to your sense of purpose, passion and prosperity. I invite you to return back to love.